Hey guys, this is Second Chance Stables, and I'm just going to give you guys some updates on um, my whole stables. Yeah, okay. So, uh, okay, I'll start at the bottom then. I got a little sign that says, Welcome to Second Chance Stables, because it looks a bit empty. So, yeah. <laughs> um, and I decided to get, like, all these little name plates for the horses. But I didn't like glue them there because I switched their stalls a lot, so I just used tape. Um, and they had all this decorative sand that I found, that I uh, bought actually. And like, these stalls looked really like empty. So I just decided why not put some of this inside. It's not the best, but it'll work for now. It's a mess to clean up. Yeah, I just spilled some like right there. My mom's gonna like throw a fit. <laughs> okay, and. Um, up here, so, yay, I made a new arena. Remember that, like, makeshift cardboard pink thingamab- Yeah, I covered it with that. I got rid of that, and it actually, like, looks like a legitimate arena now. I really like that. And it's, like, this weird thing of mine, but I really like it, is, um, you could, like, you know how in real arenas they have, like, the hoof prints that the horses leave behind? Like, I find it really cool because it makes it a little more realistic. Yeah, I know they're like plastic and whatnot, pony horse thingamabobs, but I mean, it makes it look really cool, which I like. And on that hand, I changed the entire second level just for this because like I didn't make two openings, I only made one opening and I forgot, so I'm like, oh, it has to go on this end, I have to shift everything down, but there's a little chain opening, oh, and this is just, like, decorative sand that they sell at craft stores, um, yeah, they have their name tags and stuff, and I've started making some tack, like, real tack, so, I mean, this isn't, like, horse tack, but it uh, focus, camera focus. Yep, uh, it's just, it's just a little jumping in the bubble. It's a dog collar. This isn't slide, by the way, it's gigantic. Just to prove my point, like, if that's a dog and that's a horse, that's, like, either one really big dog or one small horse. Okay, focus camera. Um, and then up here, not much has changed. Oh, this is Trickster. He moved. This used to be Dude's stall. It's now Trickster's stall. That just proves my point about having to, um, tape them instead of glue them. Okay. So, he... Yeah, what I really don't like about this bookshelf... I mean, it works, putting all of my stuff, but there's not a lot of room in front of it, which I find kind of annoying, like... It's like that big, but it's okay. Because um, I, it looks pretty cool. Okay, um, sorry. Okay, so this is my first attempt at a halter. I think it came out pretty good. Um, I actually like it a lot. I mean, it suits him very well. Like, I try to pick colors based on uh, the color of the horse. Like, uh, one of the weird things that I have, if it's a white horse, I tend to make their, um, halter and blankets purple, because I feel like it suits them, but he's just defying what my, whatever logic I have, because he's just in white blue, so, you know. <laughs> um, <laughs> so up another, yeah, this is another level that has changed a bunch. A bajillion? No, okay. <laughs> So, yeah, okay, so this is my little Dax. It's not focusing today, it's just being a butt. Okay, sorry. <laughs> um, she's wearing another halter. That's halter collar. This is maple, and speaking of which, this is my barn. Um, I think it came out pretty good because I like it a lot. Yeah. It closes. Um, here, let me get up on the chair because I'm too short for this. Yeah, this halter is just awful. I have to, like, fix it. Oh, there. Make it a better halter. 
Okay, anywho, so this is what it looks like. Two stalls. Um, I, all, I painted all of it in shades of metallic bronze, gold, and brown. So it has this habit of like sparkling. Like the floor is literally sparkling. Because I didn't read the label <laughs> until I painted it. But it came out pretty good, I believe. Yeah, uh, the doors are in two parts. Eight. So yeah, they're they're cardboard. I didn't cover them with popsicle sticks. Um, and then it's just a layer of sand on the bottom, and I just put some cardboard and popsicle sticks to block it from coming out because it'd make a huge mess. It's also connected to the pasture. So uh, there's that the big red barn side, and then this barn side. So they sort of share it. Um, and my inspiration was the slide one down there. And the Bee World Brooder Horse Stable thingamabob. Uh, it's like it's for the back doors. I found that pretty cool. Like I tried to do the best I could. Like it didn't come out that great, I know, but it's cardboard and I had scissors and an exacto knife, so I did my best and I I like it a lot, so it's a good thing. So uh, there's two doors that open here. And there's windows, like all around and I'm gonna add more stuff maybe charts a little tack hook you know all the just details and stuff okay so this water bucket oh yeah it's a water bucket um it's from a Mott's apple sauce container that I used and I just painted it black because a lot of buckets at my horse stable are black and I moved everything around. so this area uh, I just wrote this meadow is for grazing yeah it's sort of blocked off so the gate opens like that and then we have like here let me get down from my chair sorry but uh, there's just a little grazing area and there's a little round pen it opens give me a second guys I just struggle with these things. Oh, there we go. Um, and the door swings open. It doesn't touch the ground, which is pretty cool. <laughs> I don't know, I just like these things. Um, and we have another water bucket back there. So, yeah guys, I think that's it. Um, that's all of my little extra work I've put in. and. Um, it's almost getting close to summer, which means school is going to end soon, and I'm really happy because that means there's no school, first of all, and I could spend more time on this and adding more details, making it more horsey, I guess. Thanks for watching. Um, like, comment, subscribe. Bye!